Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Lady Like May. This is Sherry. For today's video, I am going to show you how I transform my nails using poly gel. I am truly obsessed with these nails. I love everything about it. I love the poly gel. I'm crazy about the design that I chose to do for this video. It's super trendy. I'm not going to make this intro long. I'm so excited as you can tell from my voice. Let's go do this. So here is the Nail Gel Extension Builder Enhancement Kit from Modelones. I think that's how you pronounce the name of this brand. It's from Modelones. It's a poly gel. And as you can see from the back, you also have the instructions. If you are like me who's also new to poly gel, don't worry. It's not that super hard to do. I will show you how. Inside the kit, of course, you will find your poly nail gel. They have it in pure white, soft pink, light pink, the light apricot, the nude, and they also have the temperature change color. Your top coat, base coat, and your poly nail gel slip solution. Nail file, and then you also have your spatula and brush. For decorations and bling, they added one glitter dust powder and one decoration diamonds. And of course, you have your dual forms, a lot of dual forms. I love that their plastic form system comes in a case like this. It just makes everything neat and so organized. I also saw this poly nail gel kit instruction manual. At the back of the box, as you've seen earlier, they were able to provide clear instructions on how to do this whole process. But if you are new to poly gel and need more guidance, they got you covered. On this manual, they were able to provide pictures so that you can follow to make the whole process a lot more easier for you. Here you can see how to properly prep the nails, the application process, and also if you go to Amazon and search for this product, they were able to provide information on how to take it off. Here I decided to check out the colors. Each tube comes with 15 grams of poly nail gel and this is what the white one looks like. Soft pink, light pink, light apricot, nude, and the temperature change color. Now that I'm able to pick which color to use for this video, I am ready to start. Here's my natural nails, watch it transform. Before I started filming, I've already trimmed and cleaned the surrounding of my nails. What I'm doing right now is I'm gently filing the nail surface to remove all of the shine. After this, I will clean the nail and remove all of the dust. And that's it for the prepping phase. Let's move on to the poly nail gel application. Step 1. Apply a thin base coat and cure under UV or LED nail lamp for 60 seconds. After that, I will select specific dual forms that perfectly fits my nails. So here are the dual forms that I will be using for my nails. For this specific tutorial, I selected the light apricot and then now I am preparing my sleep solution. 
all I need is a little amount of the slip solution and I'm good to go I am using a random cup it doesn't have to be fancy of course but yeah I'm pouring the slip solution here and then I am ready to start forming my poly gel I am using the spatula to slice and pick up the poly nail gel and once I transferred it on the dual form, I am going to use the brush side so that I will be able to form the nail. Once the product is in the dual form, I will use the brush and dip it in the slip solution, then form the nail. The clear dual form helps you see what you are forming. Now cut me some slack here, it is my first time to play with poly gel. It is also my first time to use LED nail lamp. I am super entertained. I tried to do the acrylic before but it was not for me, it was so intense. But this one, I truly love. The slip solution doesn't have scent which also contributed to why my experience in poly gel so far has been really good and I can see myself doing this more in the future. To be honest with you, forming the nail and placing it on your nail really requires practice. As you can see here, I am doing the swiping motion. Well, after doing three nails, I found out that in forming the nail, it's better to lightly tap the product than to swipe it. I mean, the swiping motion just intensely moved the product. The light patting of the product is the way to go to shape the nails. Now that I am happy with the shape of my nails, I am going to place it on my thumb and cure it. By the way, before curing it, if you find any excess product at this phase, you can easily wipe it off. This step is truly entertaining for me. The removal of the dual form. I love watching the dual form separates from the poly gel. I don't know why but it is satisfying for me. If you are like me who also enjoy this step, comment down below and let me know why. Now I am wiping both sides of the nail with a slip solution to remove the sticky layer. After that, I am now shaping and filing my nails. To finish it all off, I am applying the gel top coat and of course, I will cure it under my LED nail lamp for 60 seconds. There you have it guys, this is my first attempt of poly nail gel. I don't know, I mean, for me, it's not perfect, but comment down below on what you think. I love that it's super shiny, I love the outcome of this product. I thought I'm going to have a hard time, but I had fun. And I thought I'm gonna stop here, but I decided to recreate this design that I really, really love. It's trendy. Since I have this long, very beautiful nails, why not this is the design that i was talking about if you want to know how i achieved it girl i got you covered stay put and keep on watching to achieve this design it's super easy all you really need is some gems of course a bright neon polish and then you'll also need a tape i got both of the polish and the tape at sally's and also you will need a pair of scissors here, I am using tiny amount of top coat as like a glue so that the gems can adhere better to the nails. Now that's done, I am curing it. With the help of the nail tape, I create a V-shape. This will be your guide where to place the neon polish. The nail tape will also help you create the V-line crisp. As much as possible, make sure that the V-shape you create is somewhat alike and also make it look like a deeper V. It helps in making your nails look more slender.
After it, apply the top coat, let it cure under your UV or LED nail lamp, and you're done! And there you have it guys thank you so much for watching let me know in the comment section below on how i did i know i need to practice more but as i've said a hundred times i enjoyed the whole process i can see myself doing more of this in the future if you find this video helpful let your girl know again by giving it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't click that bell button beside it to be notified for a new video have a great day everyone i will see you next time